This Week in Action. Time has come for Could be something. Talk to the developers. Are you playing with my emotions? Let's get sad and then get out. No good to be true. That's not what they did here. When's the money going? What other horror stories can come with this? We love Tencent. Hello, everyone, and welcome to This Week in Action Podcast 56. I've barely been eating. I've barely been sleeping in Discord all day. I've been, you know, running my mouth and doing my normal thing, and I've been apologizing to people because I've said I got this weird energy. And all guilty day. All day. I actually, it's been probably for a week. Hello, everybody. My name is Aaron, owner and operator of the YouTube channel Action RPG. We have a fantastic show planned for you today. Guilty said it's going to be boring, and I said that's impossible. With me, as always, is two of my friends, two of the senior moderators, the leaders, the gentlemen that truly run this channel, Daft and Guilty. Say hello. Up on this fabulous evening before. Hey, yo! And Xathius already said too much coffee. I have not. Actually, that's a lie. I almost said I didn't have coffee today. I did have coffee today, uh, and it was about 11 hours ago, okay? What kind of coffee? I don't know. Hospital coffee? Like, no, but I mean, it's fresh brewed. It's not like... Oh, you know, okay. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, maybe it's not fresh brewed. But my wife's been having me drink these, like, zip fizzes. What is a zip fizz? <laughs> zip fizz. It's, it's like, what I don't know. What is the potato S content on the zip fizz? I don't know. I Some know. water and crap we put in the water. I don't know. It's like extra minerals. I, whatever. We're not here to talk about my water. See, zip fizz. Lady Medusa gets it. Lady Medusa. Uh, E-Way is very scared. You're not going to get yeah, into the race. Yeah, real walker. Incoming he kidney stone. Keep on putting that extra stuff in that water. Well, she has the like reverse osmos or whatever the like extra purified water, which takes the minerals out and then we put the minerals back in. I don't know. But wait, so it's like a dose of minerals inside of neutralized water, basically. I can't even explain. I, I don't. I, I'll show you the okay. bottle tomorrow. I'll be like, since we're going to be streaming all freaking I'll tell you day. guys a story later about, um, People who were activated that were given only mineral water and how many people got shipped back stateside because of kidney stones. Dude, I don't want a little heavy. I don't <laughs> want I don't, I don't want kidney stones. No, uh, you don't. I had a friend who had them and yeah, it's not it wasn't fun. If I uh remember correctly, getting rid of the kidney stones is not an uh up, easy Lord feat. Penix? No. Oh, I've had, go a long had, I've had small one. Places. It was a, it was a terrible, terrible thing. It was a terrible thing. Okay. Yeah. What is up, Lord yeah. Phoenix? Lady Medusa. I sorry, I can't. I couldn't get it. And perfect. everybody else here. Yeah, perfectly. Well, I wanted to show you. I'm sure you've seen it. The action RPG race. All you got to do is go to the Discord, last epoch, and sign up. It takes one click. Even if you don't plan on doing it, you're required to do it. What race? Not e not doing last epoch race. No, our race is different. Couldn't be more simple. In the Action RPG Discord, go to Last Epoch, you sign up. First person to find my item, okay? Aaron's Will gets a free Steam Key, Last Epoch, $35 value. First person Steam to- Steam keys are gonna go out, Aaron. I've got a lot, I, yeah. I had to, say? I, had, I had to get a, I had to get a handful more. This is really yeah. like, this is really like, okay, you're the first one to find it. You had the right RNG, it's probably gonna be me, you know? course because i signed up and i'm in this i already have I, three i already have three. I'm, I'm in this i'm in this <laughs> there are those though who you know gonna get up a little earlier than you have an hour ahead i am but they'll be new to the game so will you let me t let me finish saying what it is Fine. okay so you find the you find <laughs> the first one find the item and prove it you get a steam key first one to find my item turn it into a legendary and get plus one to skeleton on it you will get a custom action RPG hat, and I might take it one step further. We might design the hat on stream. So maybe we'll do some kind of fun, fun cool. design stream where you get to pick this. You get to pick the color. 
you get to pick uh, the bill if you want it curved, if you want it trucker, what you want on the side. It is going to be a Mesh. special There's one a special time thing. Yeah. Special yeah. one time to kick off the first race and my new item to commemorate Aaron's will. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll order two of them, you know, just to have one for yourself, a collector's edition, your yes. own stuff. But who knows? Maybe ah. a cowboy hat. Cow, thanks. I... Hoser, Bye. Hoser in uh, chat says, "Don't bother, guys. He's gonna win." Hoser, no. Hoser works all day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he gets off at four. You know, I will say this. I will say this about the race. You could start five days later, and a hundred of these items could fall. But your item happens to be the one that falls with legendary potential. And your item happens to be the one that gets it to transfer over. So you got to remember, not only do you have to find it, it has to have legendary potential. And then you have to be able to transfer the exalted correctly. So, I mean, there's a lot of things going on for this to work. Guilty, are you are you going to miss work tomorrow? I know you're thinking. Uh, so I haven't decided yet. Um, my my buddy's actually at the hospital. His wife right now, she's giving birth. So it's supposed to be coming tomorrow. If I have to bring the plunger with me, I will. But that. that oh, baby gosh. <laughs> Make sure it's a good suction one with a little hole. Yeah. yeah. Oh, OK, that's the race. Get into the discord. You could still sign up. The patch is not live. What's up, Angwar? Hello. This looked complicated, though. This is literally it could not be more. Un I, I almost said uncom. It's not complicated at all. Not complicated. Literally, the first person to find it, you could be multiplayer, you could be solo self found. There's no rules. First person to turn it into this. That's it. All you have to do is sign up. You're already in the Discord. You just click the green button. All right. You're trolling me. I'm done. Okay. Daft, how's your week you. been? It's been very good. Uh, a little excited about the game. So it's been a lot of biz on our end of preparing and on my end doing a lot of artwork and stuff this week's going well though and it's almost thursday can you believe it it's yeah so but yeah close. yeah it, oh man it happened so fast too yeah my wife was talking to me about it and i always say the same thing like how did you how did, how did i get to this point in my life where like this is such a big deal but she's like this was like a is it ever gonna happen is it ever gonna come they've been toting multiplayer right. for how right. many years because she act like every six months, she goes, they literally every six months, maybe three months, they still haven't dropped multiplayer. I've been hearing that from my wife every three months from for three years. Yeah. Wow. Uh, Hoser wants uh, <laughs> you to explain how to get the plus one skeletons on the legendary potential item. So he can do it before you. Yeah. Uh, right. It is ahead, the Aaron. only way to get that fourth golem, though. It's the only way to get 12. Uh, yeah. Is the wife going to play? Maybe. She's undecided. Well, Hoser, you have to get a key to the Temporal Sanctum, which is the first dungeon. Not the first. What dungeon is it, Daft? What what dungeon is it in the order of it's the campaign? The snake. I think it's the second. Thir is second? It the I You're, think I think it's a second. I'm pretty sure it's a second. Either way, you got to get a key to the yeah. Temporal Sanctum okay. dungeon. Mm -hmm. And then you have to beat the Temporal Sanctum dungeon on tier 3. And then you have to put the said unique into the Eternity Cache with an exalted nice. item that has plus 1 to skeleton and then create a legendary item. Oh, no, oh, pray no, it's that not it just transfers. That. Pray over. that that particular perk yeah. is what transfers over. Of or have four LP. Yeah, or have a four LP. Uh, Hoser, in my yeah. video that I recently put out, Advanced Crafting in Last Epoch, I stepped through exactly how to create a legendary and show everybody how to do it. No problemo. Easy uh, got this. peasy. Got this. He's got okay, this. I, 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 yeah, I, it's either it's either him or Rich. As long as it's either of them and not you, I will be happy. I feel like I'm going to be in the mix <laughs> for sure. Like, and honestly, if Merchants Guild, if trade was out, I would just be stacking gold. And then every few minutes checking that trade shop. Come on. Someone put one for sale. Cause I'll cheat. I'll do it. 
Don't clip that one. Shameless. Clip Don't that. clip that one. Shameless. <laughs> I will put that to use. Don't clip that I'm going, one. See, I got to solo it because that's how you do races. You don't. Hey, what? Rich hey, Ingwar. I digress. Hey, Medusa. Listen, Walker, I know Rathron. people don't like Way. shorts. I know I know people don't like shorts. Guilty is a people new. like shorts. Guilty is a new community manager on my YouTube, which is scary, which means he can actually if access it. I am his YouTube manager. Which is scary. It worked out that way, didn't it? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So when you see a mm, short uh, posted, that means Guilty is mm. just on his own. His, his, his goal is to post a short a day. So if you see something crazy, you could DM this guy. This guy down there. Yeah, you could DM this guy. If I lose to Aaron, he's cheating. It's clip. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. Yeah. no. Should, we should use that. That, that clip where he says I'll cheat. Yeah. Should be a thing we have I like mean, on a hot beat. Just bring it's an up. instant. Yami says, Hello, is your storm totem build still viable for point nine? I would have to test it. I will tell you that it's gonna be a lot stronger for point nine. Yeah. A little yeah. buffage. Yeah, it's got some buffage. It's got some buffage. Okay. Chatty Kathy's tonight. All right. Sorry if your name's Kathy. We're excited. I know. Questions to be asked. Any we are gonna start with the times because we keep getting asked over and over again when does this actually drop okay when does it actually drop so you can find your time zone right here for daffly it's nine o'clock yeah for me hey why don't they put mountain time on here what's up with that well each one adjusts well, i guess for denver, looking denver. At all right they do mine's at time. noon 12 p.m 12 p.m so i will be i will be actually playing because that's my lunch break yeah yeah and but, hopefully um little baby rj's made a, a, a nice smooth you know, delivery yeah. so yeah. you do have to work tomorrow correct i mean yeah i kind of have to <laughs> anyway <laughs> but like <laughs> no asian just, times <laughs> it's one of those am i going to things I see. I see. Yeah. Well, know that tomorrow I'm going to walk the kids to the bus stop. They're taking the bus tomorrow to school. And wow. uh, I am going to get all the stuff video and YouTube wise that I need. I've already got my energy drinks. I've got my snacks. Uh, I feel good to go. I'm off of work. So that is taken care of. And my plan is I'm going to boot it up like 9 a.m., 930 and we're just going to chat and we're just going to sit here and wait. And I'm going to wait and wait and wait and refresh and refresh and refresh. And then it's going to be, it's delayed an hour. And then I'm going to freak out. <laughs> then. Well, you don't have to refresh. Just don't turn it on your, your uh, steam on till 10 or till right, 10, you know, cause it, it, up, yeah, it launches you, at noon here. Yeah. So 10 o'clock, if you turn it on, if you have it on, it won't it won't update until you reboot steam i've never understood Rich is asking for a 48 hour stream everyone i say we uh don't do that but dude uh, i would need like a belt to like strap me to the chair so i guess oh, you know yeah maybe fall asleep and just kind of stay corpse like and then guilty yeah, would be like look look, eyes, look the minions are running for him <laughs> he doesn't even need to play <laughs> weekend at bernie style just move, exactly just move his arms Walker, I was just going to say that I don't know why every game does not have pre-install. I haven't seen anything about pre-install. Uh, everybody that I know from EHG is literally up I right think, now. I think they do that possibly for stability on servers so that the stagnated people logging in because they can't, you know, you can't everybody upload it right before and then everybody logs in at the same time. So, you know, this gives a little bit of breathing room, maybe. That's just a guess. Probably wrong. Steam can support preloading. Yes. Yes. They can, but I can. think it's up to the developer. Yeah, it's up for the dev, yeah. He falls asleep and the hat falls off. Oh, that's pretty. <laughs> I don't know. I'll probably be in VIP. Want that to happen. I will likely be in Patreon VIP chat most of the stream as well. So we'll be interacting, talking, seeing how everything's going, see if anybody's experiencing any bugs. Um, right. Now, I will say that I have been told that there, if, if 
what we now think is going to happen does happen. There will be queues. So they do have all the servers, of course, set up with queue lines and stuff um, I think for stability. I yeah, I mean, I would smile so big if I saw yeah. a queue for this game. Like, dude, what? if there was a queue to get into the server, I'm I'm screenshotting that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That'd be good. Like, oh, uh, just <laughs> like if I see a queue, I'm going to screenshot it and send it to Judd with like a hug emoji or something. OK, all right. Dark Swift 333 said that he would have a heart attack if they hit five digits, 10,000 concurrent players. And I told oh. him your heart's going to be hurting tomorrow. So I'm going to feel like <laughs> crap if it doesn't hit well, 10,000. Was... No, Walker said he's, <laughs> he's a dead a man, man. <laughs> he's a dead. <laughs> OK. Died we're supposed to go off. through the patch notes oh i guess we could we oh, can there. guilty there. before Here's we go through last thing last question before we go to the patch notes we now know yeah, yeah. asmongold has reacted to ellie we know yeah, that again. quinn has told people to get it and is sponsored to again. play we know 10 to 20 poe streamers will be on it with every le streamer what is your new modified concurrent players that we will hit I think it's still going to be 10 because of the queue situation and they're going to have to like fix fix server things on day one. But after that, when they get that fixed, I think it's going to be much more. Um, if you didn't see in our discord, we made 10 last epoch rooms. They are um, kind of segmented. I segmented them out so you could have like a leveling groups and then right. people when they get to end game. And there's a few others that are just kind of whoever. We're going to... Uh, but yeah. try and limit some of them so that you know it's four player only so that you don't have a bunch of cross co uh, conversation well, i could just go in there open. Yeah. yeah maybe so, leave the open group so what is it i said twenty two thousand. you guys said i've been smoking too you much said, potatoes you were, you were smoking uh straight up potato um it could be i'll say i'll up it to 15. i'll yeah, up it to 15. Daft. by tomorrow oh, tomorrow current... or all when yeah. the, oh, I'm when? sorry. The highest it hits by end of day Sunday. So Thursday, Friday, oh, Saturday, 15. Sunday. I, I think I think it'll hit 15 yeah. by Sunday. I hope okay. it will. Daft. I'll, I'll I'll go just under that 14, but I think it's gonna be around there. I'm upping mine to 50,000. I got some good I mean, potatoes. Uh, uh, Skeezy Max says Wilson hit 130,000. That's true. It picked up. You know what? Something similar happened when Wilson launched. Everyone started talking about it all of a sudden. Wilson will have more players playing their expansion. I don't think so. Not when it's dropping with D4. I'm saying. I mean, Hoser's 75,000. I mean, I could. It could be. It could be. It could. I mean, you do get all these big names coming in. There's been purchases confirmed because people playing the What's game. What's more important chat, is actually so. retention, right? Because if it did hit 50,000 and then yeah. three days later, it's at 4,000 like that, you know, yeah. that would suck. So we're hoping to get retention, but I'm saying concurrent peak 50,000. It's going to break that five zero. What's up, Canadian guy? Could happen. Rotten gamer. It's like Saturday, Saturday to Sunday, like that, that time frame. When everybody's on and they have the weekend off. Lady Medusa, uh, Lady, what do you Lady think? Medusa, what does she think? Reach, um, she also said that uh, Wilson burnt so many players that it might be debatable on how well their uh, chapter four does. Just going to wipe current characters. Your current characters will remain offline. And then yeah. we will all be starting fresh on authoritative servers. Well, thank you. Starting so in. It feels wiped, is it, but they're not. Dude, we're 14 and a half hours away. Why don't we just stay up? We'll just keep the stream going and then we'll just be ready to go. What do you think? Rich is down. Rich will stay. He doesn't, he doesn't care. I've got my bangs in the refrigerator. Yeah, I, I got, think they're root beer flavored. My wife got me some like sugar free, like healthy energy drinks. I'm going to have to like. There's no such thing as a healthy energy. Drink. That I figure doesn't I'm, oxymoron. I figured I'm just going to drink it and then eat the can because that might give me some kind mm. of boost or something. Mm. Questionable boost. Okay, it's so funny. Agro says you can start your stash tomorrow. So <laughs> I was thinking about it. Oh, I've been thinking. Set up. I've been thinking because I because I want to make how to build a stash video. It's like one of the videos I've wanted to make. But once you have your stash built, you can't unbuild it to show. So I'm gonna try. I'm gonna gather as much gold as I can probably over the weekend, 
and then midweek I will actually create my stash. So for this weekend, I'll just be picking up uniques and then I'll sort them in a stash video. That is for sure coming. Uh, yeah, 91,000 yeah. views on Aspen Gold's video. That will bring about 25,000 players thinking he is going to play it. And uh, he said he's he's probably going to play it. He said it looks great. Yeah, yeah Quinn plays beyond the one day sponsorship. That would be big as well. Yeah. He also um, Kombucha. he was talking about Necromancer, saying he's probably going to play that because he liked that. But the um, video he was watching had already shifted to Werebear. When that, he said mm. that looks really cool, and I think right. that's just the best clip because he's was it the Werebear with the uh, the belt it was, with the it was yeah, the, the new fireballs. one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep, yep. Diggler's right. He did say he would play after the D four beta or maybe that's... in between the betas. So he did say or yeah. maybe in between the betas. Well, do you blame him for not playing the bigger game or playing the bigger game, not playing the, the right. lesser known game? As I mean, Gold just... playing D4 will pull 50,000 people watching him. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, Maybe more. Been. Yeah. Like, will... Especially like opening. Yeah. Mm. 100K easy. It's yeah. all about what of uh, the retention of the players who come after, you know, you get like 15,000 players. What percentage I've always said that so, yeah. it's a, it's objectively it's got that name wreck. Yeah. And yeah. I, I, I went through all the comments on my Asmongold reaction video and it was funny because most people are like, dude, the commenters in his video have never even heard of this game. You know, they've never <laughs> even hilarious. heard of it. They're like, li I don't know how many times in Asmongold's comment section, they said, is this Diablo three? I Be couldn't fair. believe it. A, right. a lot of them are well wow players. A, a lot of them are souls like players. Well, what it is um, is they see. So, so this is what it was. Is this D three, or it's a Diablo or Poe clone? And it's always so funny to me that um, oh, when it comes to isometric it's action, clone, but it's when it comes to isometric action RPG, it's always like anything that view is like, oh, it's just a copy of another one. But if it's a first oh. person shooter. You can have one million of them, and it's like, yeah. oh, that's that's so, totally fine. I got, I have. There is a, a funny <laughs> story about. Uh, I was in school, and uh, Mark Highwiller uh, put a a really terrible um, FPS game. It was really bad. It was uh, just. It was based off of a topic that we're not going to talk about here. It was terrible. It would have got canceled any horrible. at any point in time. It was horrible. And Muy it said, this is uh, objectively the same as this, and it was Medal of Honor. And it was a Medal of Honor clone. They just replaced all of the assets with uh, yeah. really, really horrible things. Mm. Yeah. And it was the same game. It was a direct clone from Medal of Honor with yeah, assets. replaced paint. assets. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, it's the same thing. It was objectively the same game, but it wasn't the same game. Serious, Sam. <laughs> well, that's what you got to do. Okay. Let's get into the patch notes. I know it's exhilarating. We're not going to actually read the patch notes. We're just going to go section by section. What's crazy is when I when I went through the patch notes myself. Yeah, we all we're all excited, Judd. All right. No, get out of here. Can't do that. I was like each individual section I have made a video on. Like at some you, point in the last three. Years, yes. Yeah. No, I mean, in the past six months if you if you break down the dev chats and the news and the dev blogs i've covered every single one so like i've got like a a part of every single one of these we've already talked about multiplayer and partying and all how how all of that works item gifting we've already done it during the events there's nothing switching in it so we already know how the functionality works cosmetics so we will also want to take this opportunity to reinforce that we will not be selling MTX, which offer character power and the MTX shop is technically not ready. So we're not going right. to get it for zero nine. Uh, Mike talked about this on his Friday stream. He just said we ran into a little bug and we can't we can't do it. Just focus on Necro. We'll get to Necro. I think it's the first class. I think awesome. it's the first one they talk about under class. Yeah, it's got a lot done to it, though. Skills and passive changes, Acolyte number one. They did that for me. Did you guys see what Judd put? He put. Yes, we saw it. <laughs> it's playing. Yes, I yes. am. Unbelievable. 
Okay. Sorry, Jed. Love you. Uh, echo layout changes. We're not. We're not gonna go through that. That's boring. Enemy mod compatibility changes. Nope. Enemy type availability. They added seven new enemy groups. Enjoy. Other right. changes. This is just little like ten to fourteen. Remove frostworm bosses. How do you feel about that? That's fine. Frost sucks. Dungeons. <laughs> yeah. Dungeons. A party will use one key per run to enter the dungeons. All players participating in the good. dungeon must be at the starting zone before. So this is the key. These are the little things we're going to have to learn. Everybody yes. has well, to be at the start. You can't teleport right. in to it. Um, we knew about yeah. that uh, when you and I, um, Daft and I tried on CT and we had to yeah. figure that out for ourselves. And then we had to do it with you too. It was, it, that's from CT. That's still the same. Okay. So anybody trying to do the race, this applies. You can't dungeon. use a player portal to go to party members within a dungeon. If party members either die in the dungeon, they will leave the run via waypoint. Can't re-enter. Die in a dungeon, you can't come back in. Lightless Arbor boss fight, they have made it easier so you don't get one shot. This is interesting. Vaults of Uncertain Fate. Only one player can use the Vaults of Uncertain Plate in multiplayer. So the thing where like right. all the mm -hmm. gold and everything pops out, if you run it, only one person can go in and they now cap that you can only use 100 million gold, so, which is like, come on. How do you feel on. about that? I think all four, <laughs> all four players should be able to go in. It should be like running uh, Agreed in D3. Thick Allen, you're not finding my unique. Sorry, bro. Um, I've already got it. I'm just going to pretend uh, like I find it. So if you do find it and you record yourself vendoring it, you will win all the lulls. <laughs> Guilty wanted yeah, to put in our race. The first person to find it and then video themselves, record themselves vendoring it will get us ex extra prize. Yeah. <laughs> Quick response for shades in chat. This starts tomorrow, Thursday, depending on your time zone. For me, it's nine o'clock. I'm on West Coast, so wherever you live it's it's there i found bastion of honor in a day i'm gonna find so this so did your too. bastion have two lp no mm, remember yours? that day i found my four lp and then later on that evening i found two yeah. LP bastion i don't know if I've, i don't think i've ever seen a two lp bastion i don't think you found that you're probably that like i i was coral, with Abbott Abbott you Burt. probably found the coral lagon shield all right no, no, other no, changes no, no, i got that too though <laughs> That thing's garbage. No, it was Evan Burt. Evan Burt was uh, pulling that one. Giggity says, Aaron, is the multiplayer patch going to have the Merchant's Guild options? No, there's no factions in this. There's no factions. They haven't released when they're going to release it. I would assume around 1.0 or obviously in between. Uh, I can tell you. Oh. Wink. It is their current big focus. I would think so. I Not the masteries. because no I bet you those. factions, we get it on the next content upgrade. Well, they've already said that <laughs> masteries are coming 1.0, so we're not going to yeah, get that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are all in production, too. Uh, arena. Nobody plays Arena. Okay, campaign. Shades, it will be extremely late for you. It's mm -hmm. one time for everybody on the globe. In yeah. the Aaron's there's, buyback there's stash? Things. Hey, be, be careful with the buyback stash. It is not the same that, that it used to be, where you can, like... New. literally log out of the game and come back like five days and it was later like a storage and it's still there you, it is not like that anymore like a storage yeah if you I did that if you <laughs> click off and click back on it's gone yeah that's updated then yeah, yeah. just so you know uh, well also um I, we haven't got there yet but for those of you that used to lay there dead and collect xp that's gone too yeah if you die so if i'm power leveling you or you're power leveling me and you just die and lay there you can't you can't get experience. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't work that way anymore um they said that was apparently erroneously in the game apparently they didn't design it that way and they had to tell us that it wasn't designed that way Ooh, but fuck. nobody's gonna need that armor unless it has one to four lp anyway uh i mean not... you could still technically use it but it yeah it's secret. you don't need it to be lp you only need it to have lp <laughs> if you want four golems you're just i know right. what you're doing I know it really well, no, is so doing. okay, Chris so messing. to get those, let's face it, to get the roll that you want on a one LP item, mm. you are gonna be like hitting the lottery. Chance. Yeah. Just the way it works. Well, yeah. Four to choose from. 
It is a very rare drop with standard exactly, LP bitch. potential. And then you have a, a one in five percent chance. And then you have a one in four to get the one to transfer. That's not it's not impossible. It'll happen fairly it's, quick. It's, it's, it's a one in four uh, uh, to get it to do it. Mm -hmm. um, but that's a 75 percent chance. Yeah, I was going to say that. Yeah. To do it all over again. <laughs> Lady Medusa says like, no one power level. Aaron, focus on getting the armor yourself. First off, you already know what's going to happen because I'm a man of the community. At least I'd like to think so that I am going to be power leveling people all day, oh. which will handicap me because I'm going to be playing all day. There's no one that's going to be ahead of me. What I, what I will need, though, is power level for all the other masteries so I could remake all my builds. So I will need that, but I won't need a power level for my Necro. Uh, Jenny, get, get on. I'm going to be Big Papa Pump. Everyone can get on my shoulders. Uh, like your bleed bear. Moving on. Okay. Aaron, this question which dungeon. Should we double check which dungeon exactly to get this? Wait, which dungeon for what? Big Tid be able to put the item together that we're trying to do here oh it's temporal Three. sanctum it's temporal sanctum yeah and we were trying is that second oh, or third tier uh, oh i don't know third tier oh, oh it's temporal sanctum i thought it was third tier temporal to to sanctum third tier since it's a That's level 75 okay. item you could put it together at tier three anything higher than 75 it has to be tier four there yes, is the cool thing Jura. about the item it is a level 75 item but yes. the LP on it rolls as if it was a level 60. So it's easier to get LP on this particular item. Yeah, and yes. you could start finding it at the Emperor of Corpses. Like that. It's I, it's a it's a world drop. Yeah, I know, but I think I think the monolith that hits level 75 is Emperor. Rich, you know. Which monolith starts level 75? Is it Emperor or is it Lagon? It might be Lagon. I think it was No, it you Lagon? know what? It is Lagon. Lagon 75, yeah, Emperor's yeah. 85. Yeah. I think that's what it is. Yeah. Yes, yeah, yeah. Emperor is the next one up. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Lagon. Okay. I said it before anyone else. I knew. All right, Guilty, I got a question for you. You want me to read through the campaign changes? It become no some we're, fun ones. So we're hoping to get the <laughs> lore master on to tell us the story. Like I hope he opens up a book and shows us the pictures. Like we're yeah. in school. Uh, and I will be captivated and listen to his story. Or that will be mm. what it is. Um, combat feel we already know about this and Judd talked about it in his video breakdown enemies will now move when they're hit and based upon how they die they will die of that element it's really cool this is something people have been asking for for a really long time yeah it's nice nice quality of life there a little oh, kill. I saw that Lady Medusa and you're not wrong Ugh. <laughs> scared of the emperor I the mean em that emperor of corpses is rough well this is yeah, why the emperor of corpses has changed where if you kill his zombies in the third phase you're bleeding yourself you hit yourself so my minions hey. are hitting so yep. my minions are hitting the damn uh, zombies and I just die well, like I Aaron, yeah. Aaron target your minions I know yeah, yeah. Aim, aim your minions it, it, somewhere it, else it, stop letting the AI key. do the job for you mine is space bar because I'm smart, but you can make it whatever. Jeez, because I'm better than you. <laughs> it's not the better. I just, I, I know that that's a button that's easy to constantly hit him with my thumb to tell my minions to go attack this, not just let him run around AI style. What's Space hard is, a great is when I that. teleport with mages, yeah, I bring my mages, mages, I bring my army with me, and then I have to re-tell them where to go. Space bar's a good idea. Space bar is like that big. Yeah, it's like trying to hit um, for you. Wilson players trying to dive. I'm going to have to carry Aaron again. I love I love these stories. Anybody can go back and watch the CT. <laughs> I threw rich, guilty and daft on my back and carried them through all the crap. Oh, well, I and then the next day, and rich oh, being gosh. all the way up in the front. We and then you were running around doing one. your own thing. Yeah. And yeah. No. I yeah. The next day, then I got leveled. Being carried by Rich. Yeah, we leveled you. Moving on to bigger. mechanics. If it's, if it's the same, we don't on, know yet. Okay, Lady Medusa is correct. It's on the golem's back. It's not on my back. Right. And soon it'll not be on yet, four yeah. of them. We'll narrow it down. It is on a probably a star pathfinding. Let's face it'll it. It'll be on four. Dude, can you imagine four? But, hey, by the way, guilty. Oh they gosh. nerfed golems, so they're not as big. I mean, it's not a nerf, but they're just they're not as Yay! smaller. Yeah. They're smaller, which I don't that like that because they, they saw that no one could see anything through your freaking exactly. mask and skyscraper things. 
they were like, dude, a lot of people are going to play Necro and a lot of people are going to have a lot of golems and they're really You big. know what they could do? They could make it to where I know they have something where you can lower the skills. Maybe you can lower your allies skills down, like oh, the opacity of them. He's so already talked about that option. Judd had a long your, Judd yeah. had a long conversation with Mike during a Friday stream where they talked about performance and they want to have yeah. it where um, the the so as of right now, like if if you are casting a meteor, the meteor you see and the meteor that your party sees are already very different, but they want right. to continue that from a performance standpoint and just obviously like quality of life, you know, like if you want to see your friend, great. If you don't, you could turn off all the crap like oh, they I do mean, want that. There's other games do that, too, and it's a good feature. Yeah, it's, it's, especially it's, for like people that don't have the newest equipment. Right. Yeah. You can tone down all the graphics so your computer can keep up. But visually, you can base, you know, you can see your skills in the enemy as opposed to every skill. Yep. Uh, but, yeah. In due time. They've renamed damage types. So I don't know. Oh, if that, you guys... Yeah, that's what they're talking about anyway. Yeah. What is that, it? That's a, 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 at least exactly. Anyway. About. Yes, 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 yes. Because you could see all the minions freaking everywhere. Daft, you, you know this adaptive your... spell is gone. Yeah, yeah, they took that out. That's it's, well, fine. They didn't take it out. They just changed the well, name. It's now plus. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. yeah. nobody yeah. knew it. You, you know how many times I had it's to explain? Adaptive. What does this mean? I don't know. A hundred times. A hundred and fifty times. What is adaptive spell? Shouldn't I get a hundred and eighty percent to spell damage? No. 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 <laughs> You want adaptive <laughs> spell. It is the quintessential affix of any Not spell anymore. build. It's most right. important. Plus spell damage is now. I know. Now it's plus spell damage. All right. Well, I mean, that makes more sense, though. Grace Even period. Though you now have a grace period before you die. Same thing. Uh, it works now, though. Damage numbers. If you're doing damage so fast, this is crazy. If you're doing damage so fast with occurring within 0 0.02, it'll stack the damage numbers. To not have as many numbers, like I mean, that's you know what that's oh, not that's bad. pretty cool. Yeah. yeah, instead of it's it's better than what we've done. Like we have, we we I'm probably gonna ape that. We're, hey, we're you want to know something else? You want to know something else? What's up? Power leveling. I couldn't believe that. I read this. I read this twice. I was like, I must be reading this wrong. Maybe I'm still reading this wrong. They've now moved the power leveling cap mm -hmm. to ten. 10 so if you're in a level if you're in a level 60 zone and you're level 50 you're gonna fly you're gonna fly it's now 10 below it's gonna be easier to power level it's already so easy yeah, it was super easy before it's easy to get carried through um yeah but then again if anyone's played and i think most people have played the the most uh, season 28 of d3 I didn't. Play not it. that fast. Play a little bit. Time I heard you can get to level seventy in like an hour or something. You can. Yeah. Well, no. You you get the seventy gear and then you power boost yourself essentially. Mm. Yeah, you, see you get a no the second node on the on the altar is the ability to put on level seventy gear at any level. See, I wouldn't know Angmar because I played it once it, it, ten I years agree. ago, <laughs> and then is got the up to like second I've chapter and then played three. it again. Absolutely fun. This last one. Uh, answer from EHG. Are we going to be able to pre-install game? I asked them while we were live. Not for this one. Update will be available at release. We are hoping to have pre-patching for the all future updates. There you go. Well, that's fine for later updates like 1.0. The uh, they have, months, yeah, they have buffed dual wielding. So the penalty for dual wielding used to be 15. It's now nine. Ailments, That's they good. now That's ailments good. now reap faster, and you could see the total amount of the ailments on the enemy. I like that dual wielding. Yeah. yeah. Also, did you see what? No, Blade dancer. It, that it, it's everything. Early. Like, uh, it, it's all the trees that have something for it. It's awesome. Windy city. I cannot wait to try your necro build. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Hey, by uh, the way, which Engwar, necro build? He's got multiple. Angwar, if you're still out there, I've got uh, uh. I got one more LE video other than podcast stuff and holy smiters on it. Okay. Uh, poison got nerfed because it was broken. It's still going to be the best. Just yeah, throwing so it out there. Necro's awesome. Yeah. 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 
it's still it was pretty broken that's pretty much the only build uh of errands that i run because i'm a i'm a werebear guy but that is a really fun build only 30 only the first 30 stacks on a target reduce poison resistance from it, it used to be so you put 700 stacks of poison yeah <laughs> the, it, it was it's so broken it's very broken so all that's gonna force us to do is just not well what happened so was stacks. ehg was like dude there's four people all running poison yeah. you are talking about yeah. Thousands of stacks on the L enemy. It's gonna be like right. they're gonna disintegrate. So they had to, oh. they had to n knock that one down. Yeah. Mm, I think ignite got a little buff last. Well, what they did is they made it so that if you ran poison, you'd have to go into a group. Yeah, ignite with other poison. People. Right. I don't know. That's what I'm planning on tomorrow, but it's gonna be all based off what I pick up. Okay. Wait, you're you're gonna run poison? Just lich. That was my oh, goal. Just okay. making an acolyte, and then based off of whatever I find for this, you know, I'll just go with it. Nerf. Any marksman crew out there? Marksman like anybody like marksmen? No. They're fun. They're fun. Critic critical vulnerability. Now, if you don't know what this means, if you used to be able to make it in the passive tree for marksmen, if you put 10 points into critical vulnerability, that means you are going to guarantee crit because yeah. you'll have 100% vulnerability on every enemy, which means it doesn't matter from the smallest enemy to the largest boss, you're going to 100% crit. Uh, uh, that's, that's no longer the case. And now Max is at 10 stacks. Maybe. And adds 2% per crit yeah. per stack, which yeah. means you now can get basically a 20% 20, 20 chance of crit. It is like, um, is is major for marksmen. Major, yeah. major. If you if you do a crit build, if you don't. And I will yeah, say, this does, right. this, this does right. seem, uh, I don't know. Like, it, I mean, 100% was broken. Everybody knew it was broken. You had to right. take it. If you made a marksman build without it, like, it was very broken. But uh, and I guess twenty percent is still good because that's just on this. Well, so then you're still gonna limited. have your base crit on gear. Exactly. You could get base crit on um, other passive nodes or on skills, so you could still get it really high. But uh, yeah, it's gone. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. General skills, aiming improvements. I actually didn't see this one coming either. I'm surprised they didn't talk about this. There was an issue where um. Is it one of the the rogue um, things? It wouldn't hit. It, it hits now. So that melee aim yeah. assist now chases a target mostly based on the angle from the original target direction rather than distance. This prevents extreme air corrections that are unintuitive. Fireball. Makes sense. Anything that basically it's shoots or yeah. hones. And I was like, oh, this is actually. Like, I'm always curious how this ties into, like, because this is where my brain always goes, like, skeleton mages. Like, will they will they, will they shoot better? Like, does this count for minions? Does it I don't apply to them, maybe? Right? I, I would know. think so. It doesn't say anything in here about minions, but... Yeah, it probably doesn't. Dude, Firebrand. Firebrand got killed. This... How's it going, logout macro? Yeah. Oh, Firebrand got murdered. What's up? Poor... Shatter strike. Firebrand used to be a guaranteed crit too. That is no mm -hmm. more. That is no they, more. They removed Apparently, that. Uh, Firebrand Max another crit just, billion. I know Firebrand. Max, Max roll just added last epoch. Finally, it's up. Oh, they did. Apparently. Oh, how exciting! Uh, Captain Redbeard mentioned. In All chat. right, we'll we could take a look at it. We'll go see what a lizard and Lone Star have been up to. Lizard and Co. Uh, yeah. damage effectiveness, damage conversion, area scaling, traversal skills, traversal mm. skills. That's a big one. They, big they movement all, skills. Yeah, yes. That's a big change. They now, let me explain. Let me explain. Shared timers. So mm -hmm. they've done shit. Didn't they? Haven't they? They've always kind of had shared timers. Like they it'll were say, on separate ones. They were. They're on the same timer now. Okay. You hit one of those. It's a, it's a like a global traversal timer. Right. What do I want to look at? I want to look at it. this. Here we go. Okay. 
Movement skills. Every build has to have a movement skill. You don't have a movement skill, it's probably not very good unless you're like kicking it. Okay. Poor Spriggan. Sorry, you still don't have a movement skill. Okay. It's the only mastery. Yeah, they, was, they, weren't they talking about doing one? Yeah, they gave them another unique that does something with speed, like that low level it, it, gloves or some crap. Yeah, but it was still not really anything. They gave them a ring. They gave them a ring that you could teleport with vines, which is the same Kinda ring. Weak, though. Oh, it's but horrible. I know, but I still use item. it. Then your slot's gone. You can't. Lunch might might be nerfed, not based upon this. Hold on. Let me explain. Let me, let me explain. Okay. So they have they have made movement skills have a longer cooldown. Okay. They've made movement skills have a longer cooldown, which means towards the beginning of the game, you will be slower. Yeah. Now, that being said, towards the end of the game, you can be faster because they've moved the prefix on recovery, cooldown recovery from helmet, and they have now put it on boots and belt well, in the suffix, which yeah. means now you can get two suffix cooldown recovery, tier sevens, tier six, tier five, and double, double your basically cooldown recovery from gear, which then brings this back in line. So slower at right. the beginning, potentially faster towards end game, but they're they also just make you do it. I feel like EHG also did this on perfect. This is for you, Daft. Okay, listen up. Why does it suck that they put cooldown recovery speed on boots and belt? Do 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 in the suffix. Why? Do, in the suffix. Well, do, that's going to take away from your health do, do. rolls. It's going to take you're, away. You're on the right one because what what goes what is the what is the affix you want there? Do do hybrid do. health. Hybrid health. That's the affix you want there. Ding. So you're gonna be like, wait a second. Do I want hybrid health or do I want cooldown recovery? Mm -hmm. Or I guess you can get lucky and you can get hybrid health and cooldown recovery, but then you are still giving up a health affix because well, both boots that. and belt you can roll double health. So you that's living dangerously. Worst I Jeopardy host like ever. Do, 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 do. You're right, it's Cersei. Or yeah, I'll probably personally keep health on. So we'll Yeah, it seems reasons. better. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Kill the bills. I don't want to die. I know, seriously, right? This means that <laughs> um, summon mage, which is what I'm going to be using to teleport, is now going to be an extra second. Even though it's a long time. Wow. You know, it really is a long time. It's a long time, but I don't know. Like when you're slapping something like 15 times in a second, it right. seems like a long time. It does seem like a pretty They're slapping time. you that many times, too. OK, now we've gotten to the part of the podcast right, that we all care about. Everything else is irrelevant. OK. Everything else is irrelevant. Um, your AI, like, look, it says AI. It says it there. <laughs> it's, it, it's, when the building says it, I'm just saying. Acolyte skills. Ooh. Ah. Seriously, all I, this is all I care about. Adjusted AI for some of Acolyte's melee minions so they will switch targets less frequently when the player is near enemies. <laughs> now you're probably thinking like is that a big deal my lazy my lazy yes, necromancer this is a you might as well call that your auto bomber build this is, right. is pretty much it yeah but i'm not using numlock no this you're not. is you don't a need numlock. huge yeah, using upgrade this is a huge 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 upgrade because it is annoying every time you move the minions run to you then run to kill the enemies then you move yeah. then they run to you then they go and kill the enemies that will not happen anymore. So there, hey, look, a build that got buffed. Very Just good. Just hammer your space bar. Oh. It'll stay there. Mm. Saying. Yeah. Move your mouse cursor and hit the space yeah. bar or A natively, but space bars. Yeah. Whatever you're forward. using for. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, I, I, I agree with Daft. Space bar is the best button for that. Yep. Uh, Abomination, who has been broken, has been nerfed. So any yeah. Abomination fans out there. I haven't played Abomination like ever. 
Yeah. Well, first, these are, I think I did it once. Aura of Decay, Bone Curse, little changes, nothing uh, big. But Abomination they are, but. was such a pain in the ass to, to pull off. Uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, Bone Golem. Oh, what's this? What's Three this? Blade. What's this? There's something in the air. What's this? What's? I'm not very good at singing either. Bone Golem. <laughs> Acolytes with Bone Golem specialized will receive a free automatic respec. Yeah, added multiple new nodes, including Death Chill. Tower of Bones. They added that across the boards. Here we go. Free Look right here. Back. Tower of Bones grants 6% increased size from 10. Yeah. Oh, so you can put little guys. you could put four note you could put four points oh, into it. No. So we're going to be losing broken. we're going to be losing 16% oh. in size. 16% in oh, I'm size. I'm so sorry yes, for Yes. Oh, that's God. what she said. Shrinkage walker. Cold room. Getting smaller. Uh don't care, don't care, don't care. Uh, yeah, most of that crap we don't care about, right? No, there right, is right, there is. We don't care about any of that stuff. There's two things in here that one's good, one's bad. Your fire golem, golem, your fire golem does more damage over time, which is a buff to right. fire necro. Yep. But your fire golem no longer has a hundred percent melee ignite chance. So oh, 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 you're giving up your ignite chance. Actually, honestly, they've also the melee attacks base is now converted to fire. It wasn't dude. Golem's going to be so good. Like. It, it, it's still really good. No. And you if you guys get four of them before he does. <laughs> what I'm saying is that the fire necro version of the build. They buffed it again because now the base golem is fire. And it right. does more damage over time. It just looks a little smaller and it doesn't have a melee ignite chance, which is fine because it's still going to have a ignite chance. Yeah, right. So, so it does more damage, damage and its base damage is better. Chaos theory. Yes, that would be cool. Actually, I want to see what that Frost looks like. Golems. If you can get them and, and record it somehow and then sh send it to us. Well, I thought it would be cool if it was like a four player party. Right. One doing bone, one doing fire, one doing cold, one doing blood. And there's like 16 golems and all four of the different versions running. Around. Dude, we're gonna have, we're gonna do some fun stuff. That could be fun. That could be fun. All right. Do we need to talk about? We already talked about golem. Like, do we need to talk about anything? Else? Um, all right. We'll keep going. We could keep going past. No, the thing. no, no. Dread shade nerfed into oblivion. Oh. Oh darn. This is this Dreadshade. is something you should care about because this is Dreadshade now only buffs me and not you. So now I can't now I really can't put you on my golems back. Yeah, you know? why would they change that? It that seems is, so great. Well, what they could have done is they could have said, um uh it only buffs party members at fifty percent of what it was, so, or twenty five percent or something, you know. If you sure. guys did get the ch a chance to play in, in CT, this buff was there. I experienced this buff. Yeah. Yeah, that's a bad one because it's, you know, you're trying to you try like dread shade is like a great skill for multiplayer. It's a support skill. Like, so you want I would think you'd want people to play together. It's a whole multiplayer patch. That's a weird one. And it was it maybe it was really good because it kind of was. Good. And if you didn't like separate and stay together, it was. Pretty good. Oh, it's really good. It it's supposed to be. It's really good. So you get like a paladin with holy aura and a dread shade. And you just run around just <laughs> murdering everyone. Anyway, yep. says EHG don't allow aura bots. <laughs> yeah, they don't like that. They don't like that. No, Lingering right. souls, infernal shade, rip blood, sacrifice, soul feast, summon skeletal mage. I'm just looking at the minions. I'm so bad. Uh, yeah. Archmage required you can two see. points. You, skeletons won't matter because taking your armor removes your ability to have them. So true. Uh oh, easy. I think I found a screw up. You guys want to see this? I think I found a screw up. Yeah. Uh, added a new node, Grave Passage. When you directly cast Summon Skeletal Mage, you are teleported to the target location. Summon Skeletal Mage now has a four second cooldown or four second cooldown which is shared with transplant and reap uh does hey, skeleton mage have a four second cooldown it might now transplant is five 
right? Yeah. Well, yeah. Wait, maybe I'm, maybe trans why. maybe transplant maybe was it's four. A special way to do it. Maybe transplant was four. We'll see you tomorrow. They're doing things. Transplant oh, has a five second cooldown. Yeah, Dude, right there from if, four. What if skeleton mage has a four second <laughs> cooldown? If it does, then then that would be the way to take it. That would be the way to go. Oh, we went way far down. Yeah, dude, I mean, that a... would be. Um, I'm never gonna find that spot again. I, I you, you know, they probably went through this. That's probably accurate. It's not accurate. Maybe it is. Maybe it could well, be. We'll, we'll see. We could ask them to change it. They but said look, it, would... it says Summon Skeletal Mage now has a four second cooldown, which it shares with trans. Oh, it shares with transplant. Shares. That's yeah. Mm hmm. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Necro, such a good class. Yes, it it even has Necro has a free. Better, <laughs> faster movement skill. But how often are you casting your mages? Every four seconds. Well? Why? How often are you casting mages if you're running golems? Because you're wearing Aaron's they don't, will. They shouldn't be dying. So no, you're no, you don't get it. You're not casting them to resummon them. You're casting them to teleport. But you can't. It, ju cast it just them it just makes one armor. anyways. See what I'm saying? Sure. So yeah, so, so daft. So I, as I'm running, I am teleporting, which moves my whole army with me every four right. seconds, and I can get that down to under three seconds with cooldown recovery. I sure. mean, I guess. Getting so up you're to gonna be five and then doing the yeah, you could do that until you get your armor. So inside of Necromancer, you will have the fastest movement skill in the game without having a movement skill. Right. There is no, that. Yeah, that's what it does say that. That's what it, it says. says that. I like I guess this game. You wanted to use it to be I mean so I like it, using wait, it. Wait, for wait, wait. Does it also skill. cast meteor? Because I have a, if it also casts meter, <laughs> we know who put it in. That has to be a minion meteor, so you get the same stats as minion fire. Like a skull coming from this. Judd nerf, no, don't nerf it. Don't, don't clip oh, yeah. this. We don't want anyone to see it. Delete it this up. part. Clip everything. Request the nerfs, everybody. Dude, they're going to be like, send this is what's going to happen. They're going to be like, listen. This needs to be nerfed. This is technically a free movement skill for Necromancer, so we actually think it should be worse. So we're gonna add two seconds to it or something, and then I'm just gonna find guilty and I'm gonna choke him out. He'll live. Oh, okay. It's because Aaron can't choke guilty out. It's because he's too tall. I can't. He's got to get on it like a step stool. Mage for the win. Woohoo! To be honest, it's about keeping minions safe, not the actual movement increase. Uh, I can tell you through experience, uh, leveling my necros literally three times in the CT, you will not care about making your skeleton mage. You will care about how fast you could get through the map. Eway, there's always an EHG spy in here. Always. No, there's no one in here. Steve, are you out there? Literally, there probably is because every EHG person Steve, I Steve, Judd, Mike. Yep. I am looking at my Discord. Oh, Reamer, every single one of them is. I'm Every single one of them is green dot right now. Fancy. A lot of things to check. Can you run zombies now with your build, Aaron? Yes, 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 yes. Fire Necro, you have to run zombies. Nipsey. It's your kill threshold, and they are the best dot minions you have. You can scale them to be pretty cheap, too. When you teleport Cast. as a mage, you get a stat buff. So sometimes I teleport in the same spot for the boss. <laughs> he went. Yeah, yes, re yeah re in spot. Yeah, like remove transplant. A lot of people use transplant. Uh, uh, I think Death Knights. If I remember correctly, I think Death Knights got a buff too. No longer have ten melee necrotic by default, but basic attack base is necrotic from physical. So this is really this is what they found. Just as a little FYI, when they were going through all the skills and checking every single node, every node for every skill was checked. And they found out that, for example, here, Summon Skeletal Mage Death Knights, it it didn't convert the base to necrotic. So the base was still physical. So now the base will be necrotic, and then they just take away some of the necrotic damage, but it's still better. So again, 
Lazy Minion is going to be even better because we use Death Knights. I mean, well, Rich, that's assuming you're making a mage army or like a, you know, army. If I use it as a lich, then I use it as an AOE, PBOE, so oh. you can teleport right in the or uh, basically do two spots and then you get a bunch of damage. Yes, you Rich, damage if you route. are not running zoo, so if you're like, there's a yeah. lot of like, I only run Abomination, I only run Golem, I only run Wraiths. So when you're running individual minions that you're specializing in, yeah, you don't. Maybe you take transplant. Yeah. Uh, Lady Medusa says, check the chat list of people in Twitch. I don't remember all the EHG names. Okay, so the one that is best to remember is um, the 11th Hour Games account. That's yes. Judd. Mm -hmm. All right, let me see. I think it is all the time, yeah. That's what he goes in as. Mm -hmm. And then Discord, he is Mox Jet. Yes, he is in our Discord. Shh. No. Yeah, but don't. Yeah, don't bug him. Don't for, bug him. For a patch. <laughs> no, they're busy. They're not. They're not in right now. They're not in right now. Okay. Summon Wraith, dude. I have one ask for Wraith. Man, I wish they could make Wraiths cold. I wish you could make a full synergize cold army. That hasn't happened yet. Wraiths melee attack smaller. Yeah, Wraith node. No. Future Wraith. So guys in chat. A little stuff. You could just list what you guys playing tomorrow. Just want to see what the kind of like, uh, what the, you know, overall is for most players. Man, they completely changed up Transplant. It has the most... Void yeah. Knight with Rive. That's... You know what, dude? Awesome. It does have a lot Matt of changes, Gilly. Aaron. There you go. That's 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 the most unique one up there. Because everyone's like, I'm going to play Necro. I am... The, as soon as I am done with all my Necro I builds... As soon as I am done with all my Necro builds, I will be making my Unstoppable Rive Paladin. I love Rive, and it, the v new VFX looks really good. And they have updated where you could be weapons master in there. Rive is a yeah. really, really cool out, skill. Though. Really cool. We've got uh, Captain Redbeard's going to run Pally. We've got Zen uh, running Poison Spriggan, which is awesome. Yeah. Awesome. We've got some uh, Slot Tegas running Sork. Uh, Rich is going to run everything, like every class. Um, <laughs> By the end of the day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. And have them up to 100. Yeah, um, all of them. We got some uh, just any any variant of rogue. Smited on. Ryu. I got rogues in there. Yeah, that's good. Sork. It's good to see a spread. Yeah, uh, actually, it's great to see yeah. that everyone is not actually playing Necro. Yeah. Good. Not that I don't like Necro. It's just that we oh, can't let everyone more out there. Oh, Firebrand. Yeah. How's Firebrand doing? Where are the hell's? Illuminating fire grants 2% crit chance and 2% crit multi per stack consumed from guaranteed crit if consumed with at least three stacks. <laughs> yeah, that's pr literally. That's a... So it's yep. taking you from a hundred percent to six, six, <laughs> six percent. That's like, I mean, they just real, they just reeled it in a little bit just to make sure it was fine. Was it broken, maybe? Dude, you know what sucks about this? This is, again, we're like, you could lower it to 50%. Uh, I bet you Forge Guard is the least played class on the yeah, of I've every mastery. Uh, I think it is. It's my I bet you it's the last. Class. Yeah, I haven't even played one. Never, Never. is my Never. least played class. Right, I, 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 I'm sorry. I, I, don't mean, I don't mean Forge Guard. I mean Spellblade. I mean Spellblade. Oh, oh Spellblade. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I have, you know, I've never run Spellblade. Wrathron yeah. likes it quite a bit. Well, Shatter Strike's a lot of fun. Right. His Lady, Mid that's, that's Lady Medusa build. thinks she knows how to play. Sorry, Lady. I, didn't I bet she owns you on Shatter Strike. <laughs> no, because she's going to make that B build and then buzz and uh, freeze yeah. every time. That cheating that's freeze. A fun build, though. I love Shatter Strike and the new VFX for Shatter Strikes, too. 
And you get to start the B build early in the game because yeah, because you B grab stuff those early. Drops early, so you can use those or you can use the rainbows, and then you switch out when you get them. My Shatter the King sword. build yeah. is probably up there in my top five, but every build I have ever messed around with is centered around this. So it had to be like back. <laughs> yes, Lady Medusa. How did they go back to the drawing board? Got to re rescope it, Aaron. I know. Retool these things. I know. But that's good. I mean, it's nice. It's kind of refreshing the game. So builds are going to have to be updated and that whole thing. And a lot of the build guy, you know, all those build people, they're going to have to go through. I get constant questions in Discord. Hey, is X still viable from 8.5? Well, yep. like, <laughs> yeah, no, not really. Uh, Maybe. <laughs> Bleed Bear used to be viable. It. I haven't found a really good Bleed Bear build for current stats yet. Got to make one. I have to. I'm still. I'm still yeah. fishing. Is there any um, trading in multiplayer now? There'll be item gifting and trading will be coming pretty quick. How long do you guys think before they add that in? Before 1.0 or at 1.0? I bet you we get something in three months. I'm not saying trade, but I bet you we get 091 in three to three something. and a half months. Something, yeah. And it's probably something that they're already working on because they've been working on this for a while. Matt saying yeah. hello. A year, they've been maybe a year straight on this one patch. Fury like, Leap. This, they, what is this, 60 pages of patch notes or something? Fury Leap it got some... an epic patch notes. Yeah, this is a book. Yeah. We're on page six. Freaking novella I mean, up in here. Uh, I want to play with Fury like Leap, too. I know, I know they buffed Fury Leap and they changed up the skill tree a lot. That was a really, really old skill tree. That was in from Kickstarter. Kickstarter, yes. So I, I want to mess with that. Uh, that's... Hmm... <sighs> Added a new node, Wings of Endurance, which heals you and your minions for 50 health when you land. That's pretty cool. So you could right. jump the like. Oh, and you could cleanse your ailments. Correct. Yeah. The, um, what I was telling one. you guys about stuff in the the skill tree on CT that had changed. Some of this is that. Right. Um, Added a new node, Wind Hammer, which gives 1% more damage per. What is it? Meteor travel or. Er, traveled. So the farther you jump, the more damage. Yeah, uh, yeah. The further you go, the more damage by one percent. And I, yeah, I, it doesn't say it's one percent per meter though. It doesn't say what the scale is. I would like to see what the scale is. On. See it, yeah. I want to get to like uh, it's built in Unity, so every um, like Unity S unit is actually um, equivalent to one meter. I want to oh, get the more to, you know. Ooh, what, do, what do they do with Ballista? Oh, I haven't used that yet. Haven't had a build for it. Yo, I Aaron, I really enjoy your Alpiner. build videos. Keep up the good work, sir. I was thinking of getting into Last Epoch the other day and read that 09 would come out now. But what time would it be out? Where are you at? I got yeah. you right here. It's 12 Eastern time. Here are the time zones. Here are the time zones. Nine. West and if you haven't bought the game yet, get it in my Nexus store. Still get a Steam key, but it helps. Same me. price. Same price. And yes, tomorrow will be the best time to jump in at any time. Actually, I can't say that. If the servers work tomorrow, it'll be the best time of any time. <laughs> 13 hours from now, it launches. Yes. Essentially. 13 hours and some change. So wherever you are in the world, it applies that way. How would you level a swarm blade char to get the point anyone? I would just get on a golem's back and uh, no. just... Huntgar no, no. didn't play slots. No. Who played slots? No. Huntgar. Oh, Hunter. <laughs> Feels bad. Uh, honestly, this is what you do. So listen to me for a second. You want to progress your character as normal. Okay, progress your character as normal. Obviously, put in a very basic loot filter. For me, I literally have one rule. I put in one uh, rule. That's horrible. I put in, I recolor every minion affix in the game, all of them, to whatever color I feel like. And that's it. And then I just start running. See, I make my first loot filter gear wise and just based off of getting life and health. Waste of time. You don't need to do that. You do, because by the time you get up there and you need to fill in those resists because you're dying all the time like Aaron. So, you refer don't want to, do to that the way. short, 
Daft's resist build, like, order of resist to collect. He, it, it's in the short. I put in one rule. Right. Anyways, do whatever you want to do. Anyways, just progress how you want. Gear up right. your character. Once your character, you feel like it is strong, strong enough, turn right and go into the monolith. Level up. Then once you're leveled up and you need idle slots, go back into the... Go back into the campaign. Unless you've never played Only the game before and you want to experience the yeah. story. If you're new to the game, don't listen to Aaron at all. Just play through the game and at least until you get your idols, which is in Hyboria. It's the then snow level. Run it's the off. snow yeah. level. Like, if you've never played the game before, uh, there you'll is get, more. Yeah, um, you get all the different mechanics involved by that point. Several bosses. You'll start to understand that. Then head to the monolith because you won't just die if something hits yeah. you, you're gonna it, it, as soon as you see nagas make sure you have poison resist on that's all I yes. Can say. yes is there a standard the loot filter no there's not a standard loot filter but in aaron's boot camp videos on my youtube i do have how to create your own loot filter yeah yeah or so i'll be posting yep. one in the morning as well that'll be in there actually um daft's um the way daft makes his loot filters is pretty methodical he does. He's good at all the leveling ones for sure. So these are the times for tomorrow. What time? What do, what do I got? Let's see, 12 hours. I got 12, 13 and a half hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 13 hours and uh, was it 26, uh, 30, mm -hmm. 36 minutes. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. I'm glad I went to the top. So now I could just jump down. I want to look at sentinel skills, starting with oh no smite. There's oh, nothing. Oh no! Soothing bomb ah. now gives fifty percent increased health regeneration. Buff smite. Buff. Wow. Forty to fifty. Fixed a mm. bug where reduced cast speed convictions now scale. Fixed. It's a bug. And fixed a bug. Didn't touch smite. Good. No, oh, left alone. Mine's awesome. That's oh, also like the go-to. Touch it at all. It's your thing. It's like I the thing like you have that. if you're playing that. Eye of the Tiger, if you're in our Discord, I'm going to just post it as a pinned thing. In yeah, yeah, join LA the Discord. Um, it's just a copy and paste thing. You take it and you copy the, the file that'll be there, and then you go to the buttons and it'll say paste, basically. Yeah. Also in the Discord on our last epoch tab, there is going to be a sign up that is open until eight o'clock Eastern time tomorrow for, for you to for the join race. the contest, the race for Aaron's will. The race, get in the race. Oh, uh, Jake the Snake, the implicits on the new gear looks pretty dope. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Uh, yeah. And Actually, the Jake the Snake fantastic. documentary from a few years ago on Netflix. It's a really good documentary. It's really sad, too. Uh, yeah yeah um yes is there a leveling guide no i don't have a leveling guide i don't want to get on my leveling rant because then daft's gonna be like bleh, bleh, bleh. okay so um <laughs> Darren and i do this <laughs> thing no where we oh, omit <laughs> the story completely and just go as quickly as possible to monoliths and daft does this thing where he replays the entire game over and over and over again until the point where it is second nature and he knows where everything is. Daft is really good at the campaign. He doesn't even need to look at the map. He could tra traverse it without looking at it. Yeah, yeah. He doesn't even have to look at your screen when you're like lost. He yes. just remember lost when we had the uh, update issues with the quests and the maps and stuff and yep. Yep. you're He's running like, all over. I'm like, just go here. Just go there. Yeah. And they're like, what? He didn't even have to, to look go at here. the screen. He, he didn't even have to look. He already knew what the mess up was and how to fix it. So. I know. By the way, that's what it is. Over the next four days, I'm not kidding. I'm going to be live before it's before the patch is on. And I'm just going to be kicking it, waiting to download it and be like first one in the queue. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. But first one, hopefully get on the server for the next four days. I'm going to be drinking right. energy drinks. We're going to be playing together. We're going to be giving away games. Might be spinning the action RPG wheel. We're going to be hunting loot together. We've got a race going on. I'm going to have multiple people in the VIP chat in Discord, yeah. we're going to be showing off our items. We have 10 multiplayer parties in the Discord set up. It is going to be so much fun. Join the Action RPG Discord. I'll be live. And if you haven't followed this channel yet, that's all you got to do to get in every single giveaway each day. OK, Discord is in the chat and you could still get into the race. You literally just join the Discord and go to the last Epoch chat 
and you hit accept on the link. And the race is first one to find my new unique item coming to the game, Aaron's Will. First one to find it gets a Steam key. First one to find my item and turn it into a legendary with plus one to skeleton will get a custom action RPG hat that you get to design yourself. Which is a new thing. He's never done that. So that's a bonus. I've literally never yeah. done that. Yeah, You've this done is a special occasion. Okay, yeah, wait, wait. Done I them ha- where he's I've made them, made- but. I have made one hat for one person ever who had a custom order, and that was Captain Neckbeard, Captain Neckbeard. Oh, who yeah. wanted that purple mint green. That's how he got the item. Yeah. Um, long story. For those there. of you watching, it's not long. Well, that's a short, but it we happened, were, I guess we a long streaming. time ago it happened last year. Judd was in stream with us. Captain Neckbeard had won at, at, at the casino. And uh, he hit a sixteen. He, how, he hit a sixteen parlay in football betting. If anybody is sure sports did. better, um, yeah. and and he asked Judd how much, how many subs would it take for Aaron to get a an item in the game, and he said the number, and he mm-hmm. said bet, and that's what happened. That's <laughs> yeah. how, Aaron, yeah, it came like that, and Judd held to his word, and you know, about two weeks later, we started. Uh, to, developing designing with with the hg uh, about month and a half two months of development on that and uh yep. back and forth back and forth no 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 and then a yes yeah that's how it, at that short story it's a short story and then the uh yeah that's how it happened it took yep. a while for it to actually come to where we are now it was about a year ago now so oh, i like for whatever yeah, reason i can't make it bigger cap's oh. hat Caps hat. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. The, the, the minty yeah. green yeah. around yeah. the uh, yeah. yeah. Caps hat. It's a good. It's a good looking hat, and it fits his head perfectly. Big head. head perfectly. Uh, yeah. I'm rolling Primalist, and I'm trying to decide on Druid or Beastmaster. My second is going to be Warpath Paladin or Void Knight. Ellie is fantastic. I love it. Uh, Great. Fun game. Okay, if you do Beastmaster, I recommend Squirrels. All right. Mm-hmm. If you, yeah. Herald of the everywhere. Scurry and turn your wolf pack into leaping frenzied squirrels. That's zizzies. Uh, so for me, I, if I really do like the it, unique though. I need drops as LP4, oh, cool. it's like get a headhunter. Exactly. Yep. Uh, lunge, I got to check for Angwark. Crusader's Fury now grants Void Penetration. Nope. Voidbringer now also converts Lunge's base from converting to bleed. Hmm. Um. Bourbon. Jake the Snake. Apple juice. Apple. I mean apple juice. Apple juice. Apple juice. Apple, apple juice. juice. Oh, what are you drinking? Yes. Yeah. Should be what are you not drinking? <sighs> Uh, I don't see Javelin. How's it going, Etch Sketch? Hello, everyone. Javelin. Added a melee node. Javelin. Uh, dude, node. Buffalo Trace is my drink, man. Yes. Good Good choice. Boy. Dude, Holy Smiter got a buff overall. So, yeah. Yeah. That build is awesome. Okay, we're done looking at skills and crap like that. Let's go through these bottom things in the patch notes. Oh, we're like done already. Okay, we'll look at one more thing. Yeah, we ran through it. Uh, We didn't mention bleed. There's a thing with bleed. bleed. Nobody cares about bleed. Everybody cares about bleed. Rogues care about it. They have a section in here on chat and social. I wonder if we can link items. I didn't read this. Mm. Oh, my daughter just slipped me a note. Wait, yeah, uh, Lady Medusa Help. says Perry just, is going javelin. Let's it's me as, I, uh, me as no I nice. love, 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 or I guess heart, 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 heart. You, lots of hearts. We'll assume that. I I don't yeah. see a you there. She could be no. referring to her drunkle guilty. No, it's there at the very, very fact. Very. Oh, it's written in in. See it right font. under that. I can't get it to focus. It's the last Ever thing. Ever since written. you moved into the back section of his house and he hasn't found you yet. 
I know. Yeah. yeah. Well, I, I'm in the basement. Yeah. Is that the number like, of mother, hearts she's I torn actually, out of her victim? I am sharing a room with his mother-in-law, and uh, we have a kitchen that we... She makes me a dinner. I See, like chaos. Chaos theory. Oh, Where gosh. Bear bleed love. Don't get him going. <laughs> uh, you can add friends from the party in the multiplayer social window. Yeah, the social window. Yeah, social window offline. Greatly impugned visual design. Oh, here we go. You can now link game guide articles in chat. You can use the exact name of the page that's or text not, that's used in the game guide to link it. A, no? Oh, no, that's not, not good. That, yeah, no, that's nothing. That's garbage. Yeah, no one cares, cares about the about game that. guide. Yeah, you can't link items in chat. No, they got to fix that. Not Control yet. Not yet. They're, they're yeah. going to change that. They have to. Dude, you know what the big streamers are going to be like? You're kidding, right? You can't change party leader. You know, those are like, there's these little teeny things. QOL, man. But I'm just saying there's small things that people are going to be like, wait a second. Does this really not in the game? You know, like these little, like, where's my town portal? Why isn't it in the town? Right. Like, there's right. going to be was... these small little pokes but it just takes one poke to deflate that tire you know i don't know they haven't updated in, though, the teleporting play. yet no they said that the town is a skill free zone that, that. it's freaking yeah so no dummy there's no dummy because of that well the dummy's in hyboria it's at the arena yeah, now you, you, yeah you, you yeah. To, yeah to the arena um that one's a, a misplay for me. Maybe they could do like hideouts like POE where you could go to your hideout and do that and teleport to your hideout instead of that, you know, yeah, the that's, hubs. That's a way to do it. Oh, or maybe just have... they get MTX out of that because you could, well, you know, what, what does Grim Dawn have? Little... It has yeah. dummies in every hub. They're just everywhere. Yeah. 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 You can just walk up and smack them. And matter of fact, if you have stuff on that just does damage as you walk by it oh, yeah, yeah, you're a little off yeah yeah, yeah. that's a great I part thought... of you're running through and you kill things just, i could have sworn i, I could have sworn oh, i sorry. saw something about i don't know where it was what'd you see monolith of fate no like the end of time talking about how you can't have skills in zones but, but if you open them there you go no i don't think so it's I curious decision for me to i get if they're trying to make it so you can't fight each other but you could just make your characters unattackable i don't know uh, that's more of a guilty answer for than me yeah it's one of those possible. ones lady medusa did you enter the race i need to know because yeah. eway's not going to stop telling me to add you to it if you haven't yet yeah yeah right. like go into the <laughs> le on our discord in the pinned comments about pinned three comments. down is the list just yeah. click accept make sure to hit jump because it doesn't take you to the actual thing it's just an image of the yeah. thing and you have to hit the jump button and it'll take you back to the original post i think aaron posted a direct link but it's not pinned or anything yeah aaron... i just keep well, dropping yeah. that link lower so that i could find it when someone can't figure out right we just need to pin it though and say i know i know i know Take oh. the right click. And... Yeah, but if you pin it, then you still have to go to the top. I just use it as like a, I right. see yeah, somebody yeah. that's looking we for it. We have 102 people currently. No, we don't. Yeah, we do. 102. Do. So you're saying I got, so you're saying I got a 1% chance? Less than a 1% chance? Uh, you're not winning. I'm no. going to win. Like, no, no, you don't. That's no. We, we built it so that you wouldn't. My only competition is Rich because he's not going to sleep, which is because he has uh, a full time job Rich, and 100 Hoser, kids. Daft Hoser's going to sh Daft, no. while he does not play the game the way he usually would play with us. Just to prove you wrong, he's going to go in, in like Super Saiyan mode tomorrow. Watch, watch. That could be a thing. Yeah. I'm going to win. How do you join the race? OK, so this is how you join the race. Right now, I'm putting the Action RPG Discord link in the chat. There you go. You yeah, literally there. join that chat and then you go to the last epoch general chat and you go to the pinned comment and hit accept. It's actually like it sounds more complicated than it is. It's not super quite easy. That easy. There's one more get to the right thing. Can we the jump. directly link the pinned comment to the yeah. Discord in here? 
No. No, because they have to be part of the Discord. Yeah, be a Discord. Yeah. Yes. Does the new chest have a minimum drop level? Maybe. So, yeah, anyway, it is <laughs> item level 75, but here's yes. the, the biggest perk to Aaron's will. And in, in my opinion, the biggest perk. It's a, it's a nice one. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the LP rolls as if it were level 60. So, so the legendary potential. Have level, legendary potential. Yeah. LP is easier to get on Aaron's will. Well, it is pinned, Lord Henix, in Discord on the LE page. It's or you can just find the comment. link that I've put in the chat 100 times. If you just scroll up until you see a no. link yeah. that it's I put in, in, in you'll find it. Epoch. Aaron, no one wants to scroll there right now because there's so much happening that it's like... Is there? I haven't looked at it. Pages go by. I, I, pages. I, I, I am going to pin it myself. Go ahead. Yeah. But both of them are pinned. So if you go in there to the pinned comments, it's like the third pinned comment. You just click yeah, the little giggity. jump button. I've zoom giggity, you to it and I've made a go. decision. We're just going to keep streaming. Guilty and Daft are going to hang out with me until the patch goes live. Okay, so we're just going to kick it here for 13 hours. Is that what's going on? Should be easy. Actually, that'll probably All be right. long. We'll Link just... is posted in the last Epoch chat in our Discord. Yes. Guilty. We'll just read the patch notes word for word. By that, we get about third, and then we'll read oh all the comments. God, that's, what, that's what you said we were going to do earlier when I wanted to And then to we'll make myself. it. We'll we'll <laughs> be asleep within an hour, and then we'll be Wait, fine. Oh, we'll read everyone a bedtime story. Oh, sixty. The race probably should have had thoughts. its own chat channel. Too many channels. Uh, the race does have its own chat channel now for when you have to prove it. Item and showcase. There's, there's, the and, item showcase is kind of yeah. item showcase. Yeah. Yep. Obviously, other things will be there, but that's kind of the generic spot. I try not to make too many erroneous channels because then you just have dead channels all over the place because no one's actually using them. Well, so, I need yeah. to sleep tomorrow. The patch goes live. I have to work tomorrow Walker night. Walker says marathon. Okay, um, so this right. is how I want to close out this stream because this podcast is normally 90 minutes. I know I said this. I'm just going to say it one more time. Far past okay. that. I'm off work for four days. I will be streaming Saturday, Sunday, mo Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday over the next four days. I don't know if they're going to be six hour streams, eight hour streams, 18 hour streams. I was just going to see how it's going. OK, I'm going to be in the Patreon VIP chat for most of the streams. OK, I know at least Daft and Rich will be starting with me in the morning. Guilty's undecided because he has this thing. I'll, I can't. No, I will be starting when it launches here. I can't spell it. Morning you got one of those J O J O somethings. J O. No, my buddy's Thomas. having a baby tomorrow. That oh, doesn't. Yeah, that's, that's not right. important. What are you talking I'm, about? I told I mean, him I'd that. come by with a plunger and get it out tonight, but he was like, "Nah, we can't do that." I'm like, "Why can't we do that?" My necromancer is having golem babies. That's more. You're right. You should be there for your. You there, there for quick your check on. Chat is uh, Cyberman has buffering. Is it doing well? Could be just his end. Do, do, do. do <laughs> Bring left do, up a game on her do, belly. Do. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Bit rate on my end is okay. perfect. 6,000. <laughs> okay. Might be Cyberman. Just Sometimes refresh. Refresh the browser. Yeah. Refresh the browser. So, anyways, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yes. Yes, me, every time Daft, every time. Guilty, and Rich will be starting. I will just slowly take them through the game. You know, just kidding. Daft will take us through the campaign. And we're going to play as long as we possibly can. And it should be a really fun day. We're going to be giving away copies of Last Epoch. We're going to be racing for Aaron's Will. We'll likely be spinning the action RPG wheel. We'll all be in voice chat playing together. And it's going to be cool because we could talk about bugs we're seeing and fixes that they've made and hopefully not talking crap about things that updates. aren't going well. You know, we is our backpack going to be there tomorrow? I don't know. I oh, yeah. So. Good question. Because they are I, putting I, I, in the MTX. I'll find out right original now. Ones. They're, they're yeah. putting in some MTX, but the, well, the original not. ones. OK, I've got something new I'm required to show you, too. Oh. And you could see clearly on this one. Oh, wow. The U. You see the U at the end? Uh, guilty! Oh, it's there. See? Yeah. Talking straight think, to guilty. I think it's that one, that last heart, though, is covering the G. 
It exactly. does say guilty there. <laughs> it's okay though. I mean, that's fine. That's fine. So Everyone make sure you're following this channel. It costs you nothing. Yeah. And to get into all those giveaways over the weekend, all you have to be is following. And I will show you how to get in while we are live on Twitch. It's going to be a whole lot of fun. We've been preparing for this for three years. We're hoping that the servers hold up yeah. or me trying builds and testing things out. And I think it's going to be a whole lot of fun. So get in the discord. If you want to stream with me, up. if you want to chat with me, get into the Patreon and get into the race because you could still sign up and at bare minimum get into the discord. Because if you're looking for a multiplayer group, since right now, Last Epoch does not have matchmaking, we have close to yeah. 1800 members on the discord. We're going to be running right. our own matchmaking throughout the discord. So if you're looking yep. for a party, you could find somebody there. So that's what's There's going on. Different groups. Yep. yep. This channel, it's always been about community. Like it's always been Thanks about community. It's been our most important part of action RPG and making yep. sure we're taking care of each other. So it's going to be a fun weekend. It's going to be a fun weekend. Okay. That's all I've got. Um, Daft, did you have fun today? It was good. I had a crazy day. Discord was insane. A crazy it was, day. But yeah, it was a good day. Yeah. And I did a on the fly adjustment in Discord, which is always exciting when it's live. That's it's terrifying. Fun. Especially when everyone's yeah. like, What are you doing? Big stream of I what? can't see what it is. That's exactly what was happening. <laughs> <laughs> well, you broke it. Everyone's like, Daft broke it. Actually, maybe I was saying Daft broke it. No, you said you, that. You said you that. called so, him out. I was the ringleader. I was the ringleader. Fine. Got okay. Fixed. We're going to be moving this podcast over to our bonus hour. Now, for this week's bonus hour, and this is for Patreons only, we're actually going to be in Discord in the VIP Patreon chat. So if anybody, if any of the Patreons that are watching or anybody wants to jump in, we're going to be holding the bonus hour inside of that chat. So you can come hang out with us. You can come chit chat with us. Of course, just please be respectful, but it should be a fun bonus hour. Okay. I think that's all we've got. Feel good. 13, yeah. 12 hours now, guys. So 13 get your sleep hours. Or wake up, whatever time you are. Uh, yeah, lady, he is pretty good with, with doing that. He's also pretty good with breaking it, too. Are you still yeah. going Fire Necro to start? I'll let Guilty, what do you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. Who's going? What tomorrow? Because I will be playing on launch, assuming I'm able to get in. <laughs> the bear. Yeah. Yeah. I of course I'm playing my bear. Yeah. How many it's been years leading up to this moment. I'm playing that damn bear. Yes. Big bear. Big, Big bear. bear. Were you gonna I thought you were gonna ask a question. You just stopped no, talking. I have a question. What are you guys I, I asked, what are you playing? That was the question. Oh, you were that was Yeah. Tomorrow, like what are we playing? What's your first build gonna be? Me? Yeah, I think, lich. you know, I can't probably decide. It's, e lich bear. it's either can... between Totem Shaman or Fire Neck. You know, I'm just going to go. Are, I'll go Fire wait, wait. Neck, bro. Are Fish you going to go Totem yes. Pop? You're, you're not going to go Totem Pop? No, I'm not doing Totem Pop. And Fish Slayer, you can no play thanks. hardcore characters with softcore characters, which is kind of nice. Uh, yeah, man. Yeah, Cross that's actually really cool. Level, Although, I guess they call that. Uh, oh, you lose a party Lightning member. <laughs> yeah, like... Um, if you do join a group that runs into something you can't do as uh, a you know hardcore character, it's probably not a good idea. Yeah, if you get yeah, it can happen. Because yeah, you go, you the hop in there yeah. and he's like, we're gonna run the maximum thing we can max. Yeah, yeah, fish slayer. It's uh, I was pretty Dude, stoked I that took, too because I was power leveling up. three people and I took them into something that I could barely yeah. do. And they died five hundred times. Like that, that's yeah. probably under like. Yes, there is. Fish hey, just to be clear, I did not die summer. one time on that run. Okay, we're all done. Uh, get in the Discord. Get in the race. Come to the Discord. Ask your question, guys. As soon as yeah. we're done here, we're going to jump into VIP chat. I just need five minutes because I have one more video I want to post on YouTube. So five minutes for the Patreons, and we will be in voice chat. Have a great night. I will see you tomorrow. Get some sleep. Oh, brush, my God. Brush your teeth. Care, Say your prayers. Sleep tight. We out. Bye.